love that little tune. Mm -hmm. What a night on Dancing with the Stars. Paige Van Sant turning up the heat, sizzling salsa, taking fireball to a whole new level. Ariane saying she brought her A game. All three couples, let's just face they it, did. brought their A games last night. They sure no did, and that means it. we are going right down to the wire, just hours away from the finale. It's one of the closest races in the yeah. history of the ballroom. Anyone mm -hmm. can win, and Lara was in the ballroom for all last night's action. Let's go back to her. Hey, Lara. Hey, George. Wow, it was so incredible to be here for it. You guys have all done it. It is so energetic. And really, anyone's guess who will take home that mirror ball trophy. The finalists, all unbelievable dancers. We, of course, are proud of our girl, Ginger Z. Here's a look at the highlights. It is going down to the wire. This is tight. The finals, I can already tell. Like, you guys are all good. And the competition, neck and neck. The night filled with raves from the judges. Ten. Not one, Ten. not two, Ten. but all three couples getting perfect scores for their freestyle routines. Despite a gloomy forecast for our Ginger and Val, ah. our favorite meteorologist injured in rehearsals. I think we should stop right now. Ginger proving she can still dance in the rain. Pain is temporary. Glory lasts a lifetime. But the others were right there. Paige showcasing her growth with Mark somewhere over the rainbow. You have grown in this beautiful way. And Niall's freestyle stealing the show. People talking without speaking. A moving contemporary routine that had emotions running high in the ballroom. You really brought me to tears in this one. That was beyond dancing. That was a work of art. Our Ginger and Val got their chance at redemption. Does that hurt? <laughs> Pulling off the lift that injured Ginger. I saw you holding yes. your bag. <laughs> that <laughs> bench gets me. Even getting a 10, ten. from Len. Bruno Tondio. So here with me now in the ballroom, two former champs, Bindi Irwin and Max Schmerkowski. So I want to get right to it. Okay. Good morning. Thank you for being here so early. Good Who, day. in your opinion, had the best freestyle, Bindi? You know, it's really tough to tell because everybody was so beautiful last night. But, but I have to say, you? Niall and Peter last night were just spectacular. And I think that what was so gorgeous is the whole world stopped just to watch them and feel them. And it was stunning. Although, you know, Paige and Mark and Ginger and Val were gorgeous oh, as well. Cool. I have to say that. They were. They so were. How I, was, much, I was waiting for when this is going to be how much, does, how much does that play into who will win? I mean, they all got perfect tens. So how do we know, how do we gauge going into tonight who's got the, the lead? I think, you know, judges are known to kind of get us to this point and then and then let America decide and sort of get out of the way. I think, um, you know, the scores show that uh, there were a few couple couple of points in between. It's not going to make a difference. I feel like it's all up to people and whichever freestyle made them feel some things. I, I agree with Bindi, what Niall and Peter pulled off a freestyle that probably wasn't the most difficult dance wise, but it was little, the, the, the first time that we all, I saw the ballroom and and I was watching last night like on, on TV and the sounds that the ball made was, were different. Yeah. It wasn't just applause during like a big lift or whatever. It was just people didn't know what else to do. Goosebumps all yeah. over the place. Yeah, Carrie Ananava said to me in the break, or I'm, she may have even said it on camera, 22 seasons, the single best dance earmuffs, Bindi, because I don't want to insult you because no, you're amazing. It, it's single true, best dance gorgeous. she's ever What about seen. me? I've done some things in this world too. It's an interesting to have you here, yeah. Max, because not only do you have your brother to yeah, cheer no, for, for, but sure. you've got your fiance, Peta. So where is your heart in this? I, I run out of the house before either one comes out of the room. So it's, <laughs> yeah, because <laughs> you live avoid. with both of them. I uh, not, well. For, 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 now, a moment. But for a moment, but <laughs> I, I'm proud of both of them. I think they're amazing. Uh, knowing what Peter had to do with Niall this season, you know, the, those are like a little glimpse into their partnership every time, you know, with the scratches in the pool and the slowdown and mm -hmm. the pickup and how she was communicating. Let um, me let me get to one last question because you guys can help our audience yeah. understand. After the show last night, they're given music and they're given a suggestion of two dances to fuse together for their final chance tonight. So what happens last night? They're 
burnt out, yeah. and then they go. Ginger said she was going to be up most of the night. Oh, it's true. Fusion dance is phenomenal because after the entire performance of the night, then they have to go back to the studio and start working on their fusion dance, and it's a lot of work. They're there till midnight, one o'clock in the morning, and then they're getting up and, at six a.m. Yeah. So the amount of adrenaline that they need and strength that they need. It'll be amazing to watch Bin, tomorrow. Bindi's still also trying tonight. to catch up. This I am, I am. Let me sleep from there. I want to say tonight, uh, not only will we see who wins, but Max, you're going to be doing a little bit from your new show. Yes. And so everybody should check that out. Please. Right now, though, yes. I want to say thank you both for waking up extra thank early. You. And George, we're going to throw it back to you <laughs> in New York. Thank you, guys. Can't wait for tonight. The two-hour finale starts at 9 Eastern right here on ABC. And, of course, finally, you're going to fly all night to join us live for our Dancing with the Stars after party. That's tomorrow morning right here on GMA.